Welcome to the VMware Integrated OpenStack product demonstration. In this video, we will take a look at using the cost and capacity management capabilities of VMware vRealize Business for reporting on resource consumption for VMware Integrated OpenStack installations. The overview page shows a high-level view of the cloud operating costs. These costs are based on a pricing database that compiles known costs for running IT data centers. The total cloud cost window shows cost per month that can be broken down into cost drivers, such as server hardware, licensing, maintenance, labor, etc. The table further shows the distinction between CapEx and OpEx. The operational analysis window shows the average monthly cost per VM. The table also features cloud resources and their contribution to the cost. The consumption analysis window shows the number of VMs along with the consumption allocation pie chart. This chart shows which tenants in the cloud are consuming the most resources. All of this data is useful for showback or chargeback purposes. Let us now look at the consumption analysis tab on the left navigation pane. Here, we see the breakdown of resource consumption according to our OpenStack cloud tenants. We expand engineering to see how these costs are allocated. The expanded view shows cloud instances that have been deployed, as well as the cost of the resources that each instance is consuming. We can expand a particular instance to see the host details, configuration of that host, and the name of the host cluster that it belongs to. These details can be useful, for example, to verify whether dev test instances are running on servers that are meant for production workloads only. We collapse the instance details and scroll to the right to see the total instance cost. VMware vRealize Business also allows you to compare your private cloud costs with public cloud providers in the Cloud Comparison Dashboard. Here, we can create new VM groups in our OpenStack private cloud and compare the costs of deployment with public cloud costs. In this demo, we have two groups of servers, i.e. database cluster nodes and web farm servers. We edit the properties of these groups based on the amount of resources consumed. Adjust the settings as needed based on your SLA agreements with your internal IT consumers. This concludes the VMware Integrated OpenStack product demonstration. Thank you.